we can take kids who are interested in project-based learning and translate that passion into a project that gives them a sense that the passion they have can lead to a career that they want to enjoy. For decades, children across America have presented their findings at science fairs. Many compete for top honors in statewide fairs. Several go on to national and even international competitions. The science fair is an opportunity for students to own a project, to see it through from beginning to end. It just really teaches students to persevere, find a solution, overcome difficulties, and triumph. Oh, this guy survived! It brings me to tears sometimes. There's nothing greater to me than to see a kid who loves science and who feels confident and you know wants to go off into the world and make a difference. It's a big commitment for the school, it's a big commitment for the teachers, and it's a big commitment for the students. But the end result is incredibly worthwhile and that's why it's a core piece of our curriculum and something that we would never give up. For the Broadcom Masters to really maximize its potential as a platform for STEM learning, we know we have to reach beyond the kids who are just in love with math, science, technology, and engineering. We have to find the kids who don't yet know that they're in love with STEM. Students choose a topic that really interests them. Then, like all professional scientists, they must follow the scientific method. Ask a question and do background research. Construct a hypothesis. Conduct an experiment or procedure. Analyze data and draw conclusions. Present results. Other students engineer new machines or computer programs. Engineers have different objectives than scientists, so they follow another process. Define a need and do background research. Establish design criteria. Prepare preliminary designs. Build and test a prototype. Build and redesign as necessary. Present results. Middle school is an ideal time to capture student interest and for young scientists and innovators to exhibit their talents at local and state science fairs. The best of these researchers are invited to the Broadcom Masters, a science, technology, math, and engineering competition for 6th, 7th, and 8th graders. Each year, 30 finalists are selected from across the nation to participate in a week-long showcase and competition in Washington, D.C. We're very fortunate that our founder and our CEO both are deeply committed to what project-based learning did for them in their own youth, and they see the masters as an expression of that and how they can contribute as corporate leaders. Well, the program is growing in size, it's growing in prestige. I think the word's getting out that this is the place for middle school science kids. They want to show their stuff, and so we hope it inspires the kids. That's our goal. And so our ambition is to extend internationally and to really make this the premier program for middle school kids. For many kids, Science Fair is a turning point toward college and new career possibilities. Uh, one of the kids came up to me and he was like, oh, I'm really, really interested in cars. Tell me about your project. So I told him about it, and then he asked me um, how he could get involved in science fairs. And I just, I told him, just do something that you love. If you get the chance, definitely apply to Broadcom Masters, because it's, it's the most amazing science fair ever. We're Broadcom Masters! Woo!